Hola! Kumusta? Maligayang pagbabalik sa akin channel! My name is Ovela and today I will be reacting to another TNT duets performance. My last reaction to these duets was actually a compilation of four performances if I'm not mistaken and it was very very entertaining. There were a couple that were actually awesome. Today, I have two. Yes, it's a two in one. The latest of JM and Mariel and John Mark Sega and Kim Nimenso. All right, so I believe I am familiar with three of them JM, Mariel, and John Mark Sega, but I don't know who Kim Nimenso is. I am fond of John Mark Sega because I have reacted to a bunch of his performances. I believe he came second on Tawang ng Tanghalan, so he almost won. And apparently, they got a 99% for their duet this time around. So it must be something, okay? And obviously, in order to avoid the copyright gods, I will have to reduce the opacity of these videos. And I'd like to thank my insider who keeps sending me amazing quality videos. They will know who I'm talking about. Uh, before we start, consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video because it does make me very happy and it helps me, you know? It doesn't cost you much just putting a like and it helps the channel. And of course, make sure to follow me on Instagram at Music Game News because that is where you can DM me your suggestions. And without further ado, let's jump right into it. Uh, just so you know, this video was uploaded on uh, TikTok and the, I don't know how many links uh, that you guys sent me were not uh, working anymore. So people keep uploading, you know, these TNT videos on TikTok. And of course, uh, because of copyrights, they keep taking them down. But it's so easy uploading videos on TikTok that people just keep re-uploading and re-uploading and re-uploading. Okay, I like her low range. Mm, mm. He is such a wonderful singer and I think he started stronger than Marielle. He also reminds me of Dimash Kudaiber again, you know, physically. They are more believable as a couple, you know, than um, Yumi Kapile and uh, Antenor Cruz. Unfortunately, you know, for Yumi and uh, the other guy. I don't know why, but the way they are looking at each other, holding hands, I just feel a stronger connection here. And the harmony also very nice. Ooh, nice. 
so sweet. The harmony is sweet. Why? Why? Why do I see joy and a little bit of love in uh, you know JM's eyes? They are they weren't zooming on Marielle, so I don't know how she looked, but JM is really into this, and I'm loving it. So I understand the people who sent me this request and said they felt killing, you know. Oh, yes, yes, yes. They are in unison for sure. Their harmony is beautiful. They are on the same page. It's lovely. Oh, that is so cute. See, that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm, the chemistry. Are they actually together um, in real life? Because I believe it, you know, the way they are interacting with each other, the way they are looking at each other, the way they're holding hands. It really feels like they are, they are an actual couple. Damn, bro. I mean, if they're not a couple, there is something going on there. Wow, I got chills there. That's what I wanted. Oh, yes. Absolutely. It's as if these two watched my reaction of you, me, and uh, Antenor Cruz. Because they basically rectified everything that I found fault with, you know? Mainly when it's a duet between a man and a woman and they sing a romantic song to each other, we're supposed to believe the connection between this couple, this man and woman. And I didn't really believe it that much with Yumi and Antenor Cruz. But with these two, these two, I really felt like they loved each other. And if there is absolutely nothing going on between the two, then they played their part extremely well, okay? I felt it when they held their hands, I felt it when they looked at each other, I felt it when they sang to each other, and I felt it at the end when she put her hand on his shoulder! That was such a beautiful bonus, I did not expect it, and it, it was just... Perfect, 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 perfect. And on top of that, they sang really well, except for uh, Marielle's intro, with, which was a little eh, you know? But the rest was really, really strong. So I understand your excitement and I understand the killing factor here. Absolutely. 
lovely, lovely, lovely. Now we're going to move on to the other video. John Mark Sega sounds a lot like Sam Smith, okay, in my opinion. I was told that she was a wrist bucker. Like the ultimate wrist bucker. That was beautiful. Oh, yes, sir. Just from his intro, you understand why he was the runner up to who won the actual first place. It was, it was, what's her name again? Oh my gosh, I forgot her name, but he, she has her own YouTube channel that I follow and everything. Maybe it will come back to me later. Hey, hey, Jonah. You bring out the woman in me with your style of love inseparable. I love the song. Yes, hey. Hey, Darren! Woo! My gosh, the composition of the song is very complex, man. And they are handling it very well. The harmony was really smooth. I had one tiny problem with uh, Kim's part, solo part. That's how it is, inseparable. For the rest of our years, it's so wonderful. Damn, Oh, that was beautiful. That was so much fun. The inseparable. They shared the word inseparable. Oh, Filipinos are so freaking talented. It's crazy. They shared it while singing. So, so cool. Inseparable, inseparable. Oh. 
Oh my gosh! Uh, she pushed on the pedal. Dude! Uh, the arrangement of this song is so freaking complex. I cannot believe uh, that they are able to actually follow it, man, and nailing it. But I know why they did not get the perfect score, I think. Oh, that was so good. They are so cute, aren't they? Yes. Wow, okay. Do you agree with me that this TNT Duets edition should come back every year? I don't care, it should come back every year because it is exciting, it's strong, the performances are memorable, and it's always so nice to see uh, the previous, you know, strong talents of Taong Nang Tang Halen come together, join forces, and deliver something this memorable, you know? This performance was so freaking good. You know, the 99%, I think it's because of Kim. John Mark Sega hmm, delivered something extraordinary. Seriously, I have absolutely nothing to say about him. He delivered. Kim also did, of course, but she wasn't perfect. I heard pitch problems and a lack of assurance from her part sometimes. I think if he was paired with somebody else, and I'm not saying that, you know, the pairing here is wrong, because no, they sounded beautiful when they were harmonizing. It's just that, unfortunately, she did not, she just wasn't as good as him. She wasn't as perfect as he was, you know? So if he was pair paired with someone that was at his level, woo -hoo -hoo -hoo, I think they could have achieved the 100%. But still, props to them for being able to sing a song that, that has an arrangement that is completely alien this complex you know what i'm saying like the vocal gymnastics is unbelievable which shows you the level of the philippines when it comes to vocals and singing and belting it's out of this world it's their sport that's it i loved both of these duets okay i i don't know i i wouldn't be able okay so i prefer this the song from the second uh duet you know but the chemistry I preferred from the first duet because of how believable they were, you know. Here, I don't think they were they were trying to convey like a, a relationship, you know, a chemistry between the two. But I still really enjoy their chemistry. But I don't know, the chemistry of JM and Marielle was just really killing and just so freaking believable. But the second song is more my style, is more my speed. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts. Maraming maraming salamat po. And of course, of course, of course, if you found value in this video, then do not hesitate to check out my other reaction videos right here.